the stalwart patrons say their names with reverent pride. Ho, 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 Merry Christmas. It's Christmas and the way to celebrate that is undead zombie terrors. <gasps> People in peril. Horror. Hey, my family, where are they? The true spirit of Christmas. What did you do with my family? Because in The Walking Dead, every day is horrible. Imagine Christmas in an apocalypse. Fucking asshole. Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're oh, lucky shit. we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie oh, back no. then. Oh no, what did I do? If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. Let's communicate. What happened to him was an accident. Yeah, right. Keep talking, we might find ourselves in a similar accident. You get what I'm saying? Please, you have to believe me. We were just... And it... Not another word, or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. You redneck we bastard. We still got a haul ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the hell? What the hell? Stop! Stop! Oh, shit! The let her make it, oh, Choices, you threaten me. You scum, you threaten me ever again, never. Never again. The ghost of Lee got in this guy's head and showed him the true way. Uh oh. <sighs> Fuck. Yeah. All right. All right. Kill. That's me. good. Just keep looking forward. You're gonna end me, aren't you? Why would you not shoot a man who just shot your partner? Look. I'm already having a bad fucking day here. This is not what it looks like. What, what it mean, looks like him? is you shot an unarmed guy in the back. Uh-oh, it's Clam! Or is that not what I saw? You were trained to do that, Clam, so that's the right choice and you know it. Trained by Lee. Okay. Now don't do anything stupid. Cause I'll shoot a lot quicker than you did. She's well trained by Lee. Never forget that. You're a kid. Well, she's been through a lot now. She's not a kid anymore. She's grown up. Well, wait, did you do that? With the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Oh, shit. She did the right thing and you know it. Well, you almost crushed me in the process. The tree fell slower than I thought it would. She's got what she wants, an, an apple. Put your hands up and close your eyes. Look, I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me? This is payment for saving you. The mega bar. Put it back. Now. She doesn't worry. The clam remembers everything. It's all right. Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked, and I don't... Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522, and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard, if you let me have your van. Oh. I get you there in one piece, then I drive away. That's the Christmas gift. That van is our home. It's all we got. That sounds like a no. How about you just give me directions like a normal person? How about I shoot you and take the van anyway? This is a better deal for you. Let's go. Clem's well trained now in the world of zombie apocalypse. This really necessary? I don't know you. I don't trust you. And I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. You're right. Come on. You must trust me at least a little. We're here, aren't we? I trust that if I don't get a van at the end of this, you'll regret it. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Javi. Clementine. 
Clementine is in Clementine and Lee, the famous duo. Clementine. Cool name. If you say so. Brings us back to the moving memories of Lee. Bit weird how we're not playing with the, the Clem character this time. We're playing with Javier. Why is that? I don't get it. I suppose when you play with Lee in the first one, Clem in the second one. Now this random guy. Take it down with a kick now. She's so powerful. The ghost of Lee within her. You're good at that. Look, Will Lee get mentioned? You don't want to talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. She remembers the training. Now, come on. This whole silent loner thing you got going on? Just be real with me. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh. Muertos. The herd caught up with us. Bueno. Slow-moving zombies. Muertos. What do you call them? Walkers. Demons. What do you call the ones that run? No, we call them They're all fucking walkers, zombies. okay? Look, I'm just... I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Usually, it's just me on my own. Yeah. Well, it shows. Meaning what? Meaning you could sure use a dust up on those people skills. She's learned not to trust people from the from the ghoul of Lee. So, who's at this junkyard? My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive. Surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just you look like you keeping suck. everyone together like that. We had a family once. With Lee at the head of the family. I did whatever I had to do to protect them. Kept them out of trouble the best I could. Sucks. That sometimes it's not enough. Well, how about you? Here is it not enough. You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was. But some people looked out for me too. What happened to them? One named Lee. Same thing that happens to everyone. I wonder if they're going to do a sad ending and let Clem get killed. Shit. We can't stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. Can you do that, please? You want me to trust you? Give me a reason. Don't make me regret this. Come on! There! Oh, hell no. Get to the gate! Spaz shotgun. Let's keep going. You'll open up! Shit! Oh yeah! Hey! Open up! I can't open the gate till you clear them out! Can't risk it! What the... Gonna shoot now. Fuck! These bullets won't fire. Get your ass inside. Come on now. Damn it, Francine. One of these days, those doors are going to close and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah. And when that day comes, Trip, I promise I'll eat you first. Huh? It's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there, hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. Why don't you help us, Dan? This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? 
There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. I don't start trouble. I finish it. I'm all powerful. Okay, Captain Big Nuts, we get it. But I catch wind of you finishing anything while you're in town, and you're finished. Now piss off. I got shit to do. Jesus. Tell me about it. Uh -huh. Well, welcome to Prescott. These are guys are assholes. A town of survivors. Like Megaton. It's a pretty cool place, actually. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. What the hell? The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. Could be worse. Usually I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Not exactly an option this time, though. It's just a pit stop, okay? We're gone as soon as there's a window. I hope that window comes soon. In the meantime... Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? What's the problem, punk? The door to freedom closed forever. They're still out there. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure, you know, they'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go. This, this team way. don't seem like survivors to I me. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. They don't seem like they've got the ability. Jeez. I haven't been in a place like this since... Well, you know. It's just like the old days. It's nothing like that. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? Ha ha ha. That won't happen. You know it. It's like fucking fallout now. But with zombies. Play your hand. You're gonna lose, but you don't have to do it in slow motion. Don't try and rush me. I know your game. This is my game. Clearly. Always a smart ass. Well, it ain't gonna work. Do I talk to him? Excuse me. Oh, you again. Me again? <laughs> you got some moves. I'll give you that. Here's one move. Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. Huh? For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. It was a long time ago. Should have had a 20-year career. The way I see it, nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. That's going to pay off later, his ability and to gamble. got a lifetime ban? You want an autograph or something? <laughs> if I had a baseball, I'd take you up on it. But I'm fresh out. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. Yeah, yeah well... Maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I hate gambling. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? It's fucking boring. Hmm. Don't get too intimidated. I have no I idea. lose more often than I care to admit. Though all it takes is one good hand. And it. He's bluffing. He's got bullshit written all over him. He's garbage. <laughs> is that a fact? You're garbage. I think I'll listen to the man. Call. Moment of truth. Flip them. Huh? Oh my. Ain't that a pretty sight? Good looking hand there. Well, show yours well, now. Good looking enough. God damn it. Shit, sorry. And thanks for playing. He's no good at gambling. Let me get you a drink for the assist. After that. On the house. So he sucks. Bottoms up. What is this, piss? Oh my, this smells like turpentine <laughs> that's the weak stuff i ain't drinking this don't turn away from me i'm talking to you oh shit clementine again hey what's the point in talking when i already told you a deal is a deal and it's done what's going on this guy ripped me off i traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire he could have gotten both of us killed oh yeah and who the fuck are you a bodyguard or something We'll show you, buddy. Because I don't scare easy, all right? Yeah, right? And I don't respond to threats, neither. Damn right. So you better figure out a way to fix this. And I mean real fast. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. 
Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. I could have died because of his bullets. Unfucking believable. You believe it? The Look blade! <laughs> These aren't such nice people who live here after all. This guy's got some moves. Hey, listen. Let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy, I was too. We just got a little out of hand. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus. You gotta get her under control, man. Just hand over the bullets. This ain't no way to do business. Don't give me an option to punch him, I gotta do it. <laughs> the power of Lee within us all. A deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. What the? Oh, no. Oh, oh the no. bullets worked. Drop the gun. Right now. Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You done enough talking. Did he die? Drop it. There's a herd out there and you're firing off a fucking... Look out! What the you're fuck happened a good man. He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? There's no doubt in our mind. She was just demonstrating that the bullets he sold her were faulty and the gun went off. What are you doing? All right, outside. You and me are going to have a little That's talk. That's the truth. I'm telling you, he stop. was... Stop. Just stop talking. And you, thanks for being straight with me. Go find Eleanor. She'll fix you up until her trip sent you. Now move it. All right, all right. We always taught us to do the right thing and tell the truth. Here you go. Try and get some rest, okay? Thanks, Eleanor. Huh? Was that evil to get Clem in trouble? Yes. Is this the evil playthrough? Yes. Damn it. Ugh, that looks like a nasty cut. Oh, that must have hurt. Whoa. You come to the right place. I've had a lot worse, believe me. Have a seat. I'll take a look. My name's Eleanor. Paul? Huh? Javier. Call me Javi. Please. A little lower and you might have lost an eye. Shit. And that is not something you want to mess around with. What is it? It's exactly why I keep a spare, right? Just uh -huh. in case. You know, I, I bet I look pretty badass with an eye patch. Hey, don't joke. If you lose your peripheral vision then, then where will you be? <clears throat> Won't be able to aim a gun properly. So, I have to ask. Is it true? Huh? What's that? I heard you were with that girl, Clementine. You put a bullet in some guy's brain over in the hangar. He deserved it. Don't act so surprised. Huh? News travels fast around here. Well, it would. Nope. You got me mixed up with some other dude. Some other new right. guy. Must have been the other handsome young Latino stranger in town. I'm married, you bitch. Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? I'm trying to sleep with my brother's wife. I've never understood it. Yeah? Well, it takes one to know one. One what? One married man. One pretty troublemaker. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you that one. Huh? Look, I know you didn't pull the trigger. But that girl, Clementine. She's a weird. There's something cold behind her eyes. Of course there know. is. The ghost she's of just Lee. A scared kid. Huh. I kind of like her style. She doesn't take any shit. She does what the hell she wants. And yeah, she's a free spirit. Yeah, well, she's a wounded soldier if you ask me. You know nothing. Well, right now I need her. She's helping me find my family. With the ghost of Lee, too. We were attacked earlier this evening. Oh, shit. Huh? I'm sorry. For family to make it this far? Huh? Not everybody gets that. Stop whispering and talking quietly. For being real about it. I fucked up. I fucked up bad. I left them on their own. Let go of me! <laughs> there you go. Trip, what's going on? Clementine and I had a little talk. He's letting us leave once the herd passes. Oh, I'm gonna do more than that. I'm gonna hightail you two to that junkyard myself. Thanks. Because frankly, 
I don't want her anywhere near this town. Good, we're gonna need your help. We'll leave sometime tomorrow, when it's safe. It's never safe. You two can spend the night here in the infirmary. I'll see you in the morning. He's a good guy after all, Clam. I told you to say, I told the truth. Look, maybe there's another way. Huh? We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but, well, we could leave tonight, all three of us. Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. Sounds possible like a if your complete family plan. does need help, I'll be right there to give it. What? Seriously? When you do that for a me... A guy you don't really even know? Us pretty troublemakers have to stick together, right? God, gross. Gross, she's right. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. I don't think this random chick would help this guy in a million years. Huh. Never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah. She's... Mingin. She's something. The thing is, I still trust Trip more than I trust her. She's right. But hey, it's your call. Once we get to the junkyard, I get my van and we go our separate ways. Key choices now that must be made. We're leaving tonight with Eleanor. If it gets us there even a minute sooner, it's worth it. You know, when you're out on your own, you can never really let your guard down. I was expecting you to defend me. Instead, you threw me under the bus. You basically sold me down the river earlier. We told the truth in the way, in the Lee way. I'm not apologizing for that. You killed a man. You were out of line. You know I didn't mean to do that. <sighs> Just goes to show you, you can never really count on anyone else. Clementine, I... I'm done talking. Yeah, you're right. Don't trust anybody, even in the normal world. The doctor lady said she'd be a while, and I want to catch as much sleep as I can. Fleet taught or anything, it was that. It was to trust nobody. No one can be trusted at all. We all know Good it. Good night. Remembering. Clam in the days of yore, yesteryear. Who's this kid? Was there a kid at the end of the chapter two playthrough? I don't even remember what happened apart from Kenny died. I don't remember nothing. Be gone. Huh? <sighs> AJ. We're hunting. So sit still and stop scaring off the food. We're out of food, AJ. We're gonna starve. I'm starving. We gotta... This kid must have come to a sticky end because she's not got him with her now. Totally don't remember chapter two. Forgot what happened. Still remember the adventures of Lee, though, like it was yesterday, yesteryear. AJ, stay here while I find us dinner, okay? Uh, Mom, tell me you understand. <sighs> no, he doesn't. Come on, don't you want dinner? Mmm, dinner. Yeah. There is the rabbit again, opponent. Two cohesive rabbits working together. AJ! Zombies again, where you just turn your back for two seconds and they come out of thin air. Get away from him! For some reason, she doesn't hear the footsteps in the mud. No one ever seems to hear zombies in the Walking Dead show either, you know what I mean? I've walked, uh, you know, on the countryside walking the dog, and I can hear a, a little bird. <laughs> oh no! Oh my God! I can hear a little bird just rustling in the bushes, so you'd fucking hear a clumping, fat-footed zombie a mile off. They'd never sneak up on you unless you were asleep. Well, they always seem to come out of thin air in The Walking Dead. No! Damn it! Oh no, that's not good! That's not good! 
Sun's up. <sighs> Trip's she just locked that finger off. She couldn't repair it for some reason. What do you think he'll do to you? Oh, nothing. He'll yell at me a little. Not this chick again. Trip and I, we sort of used to be a thing. It was for like five minutes, and it fizzled out fast. But he never really got over it. Not that he's weird about it or anything. I just know he likes having me around. I gotta say, I think you can do a lot better than that, meathead. Are you being serious? You know what I mean. Huh? But not me, though. I'm married. Guys, that's the place. Yeah, this is it. Oh, shit. The homestead, like Luke coming back in Star Wars. Guns out, yeah? If you insist. This is Christmas. Go back and watch Skyrim Slutty Christmas with Hrothgar. Jesus. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? And I put up Thrathgar's Cajun Christmas song video on the the homepage of the channel too. To get you in that Christmas magical spirit if you're not in it. Yeah. Uh. Nothing says Christmas. Mariana's tape player. More than the walking dead. Mariana? Mariana, are you here? Javi! Oh my god. Incredible, You're she safe. lives. I can't believe it. You told me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out, not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. I don't even know how long I was in there. Then I heard your voice. Did they hurt you? Are you okay? I hid before they could get to me. I'm fine. Really. Kate and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate where knows you mean? We're gonna try to make it back to the van. And that's where we're headed. Let's go get your brother back, sweetie. It's a happy ending, and it can't be. It's the walking oh, no. dead. Something's gonna go horribly wrong. No, no sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. More zombies. They're trapped in there. Mariana, stay back. Wait! Nobody shoots. He's right. We fire at the truck, we might hit them. Huh? <laughs> Take down the zombies, the slow moving zombies. Heads up, zombie. Javi, you found us. Hey, Excellent. hey, it's okay. I got you. You happy to see me? Oh, huh? let's kiss you and give this chick the idea that she's not got a chance. She better remember that because she's got no chance with me. Come on, I think we get a pass. <sighs> I, I wanted to come after you. I, I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. It's happily we ever dead. after. Like, never gonna see you again, Dead. What we is only it? had a couple bullets left. Oh, I thought we were done for. I know it must have been awful, but it's all over now. Y yeah, I, I know, but I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. The terror's over. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Eleanor, think you can take a look? It's okay. I'm a doctor. I'll Very come here, talking then patch doctor. you back home. See? Better already. Really? It we should be, be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? Does she have a name you want to share with us? Or are you going to make me do my own introductions? Just someone I met. Clementine. 
Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. It's not safe. No, we're safe. Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Even, like, lukewarm water would be okay. Ugh, oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? Eh, don't get your hopes up too high. It's a nice place, but it's not the Ritz. Well, whatever they've got, I'm sure it's gonna be great. We've got four walls and a roof, and that's all we need. You look happy. Oh, well, of course I am. Search and rescue missions don't usually end so well. Alive On the walk and of dead. Sort of incredible. I wasn't expecting this. Believe me. Believe to have my the family back dead. together again. It's. I'm just happy for you as all. Sure you are. You wanted me, and now you see you can't have me. You're not happy. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. That van was the only ride I had a lead on. So maybe it's time to renegotiate. I know it's not the easiest thing to find, but cool. The headphones, you can have the headphones in the stage of the van, you know, listen to the music. Forget the problems of the Walking Dead terrors. Thanks. Oh my god! I knew it would all go wrong. It's the Walking Dead. It went wronger than he could possibly imagine. We gotta make him pay for this. Javi! We can't leave her! Ah! Shit! She's falling oh. too now. Kate! Oh, we can run into machine gun fire. Stop! And this kid's Stop. gonna do it too! Javi, help! What can men do? Shot out in the open to save a body. Oh God. I can't believe it. She I just... can. It's the Walking Dead. I know, Javi, and there will be time for all of that, but not right now. I need to get Kate back to Prescott so I can help her, which means we have to go. We have a window here, Javi. We have to move before they start shooting again. I'm gonna fucking kill them. I'm gonna kill all of them. That's yeah. not gonna bring her back, Javi. So what? I'm just supposed to let him live? If you really want to help your family, you'll come with me. We can't wait anymore. We stay here and we finish this. Are you crazy? We have to go now. We already killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. She's right. Let Eleanor help them. You stay with me. What? No, uh, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please. Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, we Javi, gotta stand up and fight. Us. Please. Now Come the on. challenge is Get right. To Prescott. We'll cover you. Javi. Through the tears and the pain. I need your help, Gabe. Still Just the glory remains. Okay? I'm ready. See a winner in sight. Put our skills to the test. Be the better of the best again. Huh? Javi, don't! The grenade, get it! Heads up, enemy! No! What happened? Who did the grenade poem? We'll have to wait till the next exciting chapter to find out. That was episode one, Ties the Bind, part one. Did we stay the night at the junkyard 50-50? Most people chose to do either way. So, same thing, although a lot of people were stupid and let the driver go. What kind of cowards are they? We're allowed to roam free. Not many people told told Clem did something, and that was a mistake. 
50-50 again, not very exciting. Most people stayed with Clementine to fight the good fight because we were angered by what we'd seen. So key choices that had to be made. Stay tuned for the next right key choices. See you later. Ben found some stickers in a drawer and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. Well, that's going to make it all that's better, it. isn't it? Suddenly I've that's forgotten all good. about the zombie apocalypse problem. Thanks a lot. Oh, zombie! Strangle you, zombie! I'm gonna strangle you good! To the face, zombie! Oh, there's more! You want a piece? Oh, you want more, do you? Oh, and another one for good luck! And another! You zombie! She was pretty.